All right, guys, so we're on first break of day two of the WPT Winter Poker Open Championship, and the last player to hoist the WPT Champions Cup at Borgata is David Predis, and he's here with us today taking us uh, into level 11. How you doing, Dave? I'm doing all right. Um, got, like, a little over 150, so a good stack at this point in the, in the tournament. Um, I got a little lucky, stuck it in with a flush draw earlier. I, I had him covered, but um, still a good, ch good pot, and he had pocket eights, and I had an ace-high flush draw, and I binked an ace and a flush, so I was, I was nice, and now I'm just cruising. All right, yeah, you know, I saw on Twitter, you know, you weren't really happy with how your opening day went, your day yeah. one A session, but it seems to be working for you here in day two, right? Yeah, I got super, super lucky on day one. Um, like, uh, I played a crazy hand with uh, against Simon Lamb, um, where um, it was a three-bet pot, a three-way, three-bet pot, and I had pocket eights, and the flop came queen, queen eight, and um, Simon, I, I re-raised him on the flop, and Simon made it correct. He folded a queen face up which was a great fold yeah. at that stage in the tournament, especially with the rebuy factor and all mm -hmm. that. He made a correct fold, but it, w it came 4-4. So I would have lost the pot to his higher full house had he played the hand. Wow, okay. So in a, nor a normal person, like someone not as good as Simon, um, would have stuck it all in and I would have been out. But instead, I got lucky that he was a good player. Yeah, so. you know, when you talk about, you know, Simon making that correct call, he's kind of a player we really only see for big main events. You're yeah. kind of the same way. Yeah. What's uh, the main event structure that kind of draws you to these, uh, you know, Borgata and to the WSOP? You really seem to thrive in those kind of events. Kind of talk us through how you can navigate such a big field with such a great structured event. I mean, listen, um, the, the, this structure is second to none. Other, second to only the, the sorry, it's not second second to only the WSOP 10K. Yeah. Um, and if you want to play a deep, I'm a cash game player, so I play, you know, normally like 200 bi bi big lines deep. Um, so I'm used to playing, you know, being able to three bet some hands, you know, not just wait for premiums, uh, you know, being able to play some post flop. Yeah. And that's that, that works into to the, your advantage if you're a cash game player. So I think this tournament specifically benefits the guys have a lot of the, Guys that have a lot of experience in cash, and um, if you're a cash game player, I recommend coming out. You know, you never know. Any 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 idiot can get lucky. Look at me. So you know, that's now, the, that's the key. That, that is the key. Now, you know, we don't want to say you're an idiot for getting lucky one time because you've actually finished runner-up in this exact event two years ago. Yep. September was a bit of redemption for you. What would a you know back-to-back -back Borgata titles? What would a second WBT title mean in terms of that? I mean, to me, like um, I never really played for the titles. I was playing. I always play for the cheese. Um, um, but uh, it was nice to have that recognition. You know, I, nobody really knows me like or knew me, I guess, at that point. Maybe now so I get, get a little bit more recognition. Not that mm -hmm. it does anything for you per se, but, yeah. you know, you might get a full extra fold here and there. You know, that's so that's also uh, very important. Right, exactly. <laughs> like when Phil Ivey bets the river, like you got to think twice because, you know, you've seen him on TV. So yeah. now these guys have seen me on TV. They might have to think twice when, when I bet the river. Um, that's All right. Yeah. No. This, this is uh, not a televised uh, event, so we will not be seeing you on TV. This will be live streamed okay, and on the, right. on the internet. <laughs> and there is a lot of cheese up top. There's over 800,000 up top. So hopefully Gaucho is getting a little piece of that prize pool. And we thank him for taking some time out of break. Yeah.